Today we are talking about Ruth and Boaz. Oh, I wish I could be like Ruth. That Boaz will find me. Oh, Ruth, such a blessed story. Maybe this is Boaz. Maybe that is Boaz. Oh no, maybe that is Boaz. Wait a minute. If you want to find Boaz, are you Ruth? Five things to learn from Ruth. Let's go. Number one, devotion. Ruth was devoted to Naomi. Even in the midst of trial, she decides to cling to Naomi and not leave. She stays with the Naomi and leaves her family in order to follow Naomi and go to a land that she had never been before. Trust in the God of Naomi devoted her entire life to Naomi. We need to ask the Lord to give us the spirit of devotion. We need to devote our life, devote our time, devote our talents, be like Ruth that she gave the most precious thing that she had. We need to tell God that no matter what happens in our life, we are not going to leave God. We are going to cling to God and we are going to trust Him for the very best of our life because He holds our future in His hand. Number two, Ruth showed love in the midst of pain. Remember, Ruth and Naomi had both lost their husbands. They had died in Moab. And in the midst of the pain that they were going through, Ruth could have said, No, I can't do this anymore. I need to look out for my life. But no, she didn't do that. She showed an amazing love for Naomi. We need to show this love that Christ showers on us to others. We may be in pain at that moment. You may be facing a trial, a situation that you can't handle, but ask the Holy Spirit to help you, to give you that love. And in order for you to have that love, you need to come closer to Him. You need to open your heart to the Holy Spirit in order for Him to pour the love of Jesus into your life. Number three, Ruth. She was busy gleaning. She wasn't focusing on who she was going to meet. She was busy doing what she's supposed to do. As ladies, we need to focus on what is important. We need to look and see what the Lord wants us to do by submitting to the Holy Spirit every moment and asking Him to help us to follow His directions. Ruth was gleaning and while she was gleaning, Boaz met her. She wasn't going around searching, maybe this is Boaz, maybe that is Boaz. Oh no, maybe that is Boaz. Nope. She was busy focused, leaning, working hard, and the Lord came and blessed her. Be like Ruth. Work hard, build your relationship with God, and leave the rest into the hands of God. He will do it for you. Do not worry. My sister, trust him. He knows your heart. He knows what you're going through. He is there. He is hearing your prayers. He will come through at the right time. And number five, obedience. Ruth obeyed every instruction given to her by Naomi. She didn't know what she was doing. She didn't know where she was going. She didn't know the people around her, but she decided that she will obey. She will follow the instructions of Naomi. We need to ask the Lord, Lord, help me to obey. Help me to follow every instruction that you give. If you can walk in obedience to the word of God, if you can focus and put your eyes on Jesus, he will come at the right time. He will bless you at the right time. Jesus, he loves you so much. He cares for you so much. He knows what you are going through. He knows what you have been through. He knows the tears that you have shed. And he is telling you that he will come at the right time. He will come at the point in time and he will visit you as he did it for Ruth. I'm sure he can do it for you. So wipe your tears, ladies. 
wipe all those that have kept you behind everything in your heart release it release it to God release it to him and tell him Lord I am not perfect but I am ready for you to perfect me to transform me to mold me and make me a woman of honor for your glory ask the Lord to build you and to make you a woman after his heart like Ruth hey guys thank you so much for watching if you enjoyed this video make sure to give this video a thumbs up and make sure you also press that subscribe button below and thank you so much for watching make sure if you haven't already watched the Ruth and Boaz series I encourage you to go and have a look they are really amazing I'll see you next time take care God bless God bless God bless Woo. bye my daughter wash yourself therefore who are you? I am Ruth. I will redeem it. I have acquired Ruth the Moabites.